Next lesson is lesson 3 squares and square roots. And what is a square? Here in this lesson, we are studying about uh, how to find a perfect square of a number. Here, what is a square? First, uh, what is a square? A square means a number multiplied by itself. Here, this number 5. 5 is a number and this number multiplied by itself that is equal to 5. 5 is 25. This is the square of the, uh, the digit 5. The square of the number 5. five twenty-five 25 is the square of the number 5. This is called the square. And what is a square root? That is you already studied in the previous lesson. Square root. Because square root means square root means that is equal to uh, that is uh, uh, a number that is 25 is a number and then what is 25 25 can be multiplied by 5 into 5 and this is called 5 is the that is 5 square 5 square that is 5 into 5 5 square the, the uh, square of 25 is 25 and the root square root of 25 is 5 and square root of 36 is equal to 6 and square root of 49 is equal to 7. This is called the square root. And then uh, we can write it as if 5, 5 into 5 is equal to 25. 5 into 5 is equal to 25. That is we can write it as 5 into 5 is 5 square. The exponent square that is 5 the whole square. 5 raised to the power 2 is equal to. That means it multiplied by 2 times. That is 5 into 5 is equal to 25. That or that is, uh, let's see another example, that is 3 square. 3 square is equal to 3 into 3 is equal to 9. And this, these are the uh, basics. And then after that it is, uh, if it is a, uh, if the square, the square of an odd number is always odd. And the square of an even number is always uh, even. And, uh, and also, uh, the if a number is if a number is negative for negative number that is if negative 3 the square of negative 3 the whole square is is equal to 9 then the square of a negative number is always positive and a positive number we know that that is positive and the square of a negative number is always positive that is equal to negative 5 negative for the square of negative 5 is equal to uh, 25 negative 5 is equal to 25. That is, if the uh, number is negative, we get the square as positive. Okay, number as positive. And then after that, what is a perfect square? What is a perfect square? Perfect square. Next step, perfect square. That is a number, a number, uh, where a number where exact square a number where exact square uh, square root will be obtained will be obtained is known as a perfect square a number where exact square root will be obtained is called a perfect square that is here 25 is a perfect square 6 is this here, 36 is equal to 6 is a perfect square, 49 is equal to 7, that is a perfect square, that is 9, that is 3 square is equal to 9 is a perfect square, that is the perfect square, so that is equal to 4, uh, 4, uh, that is 2 twos are 4, 3 threes are 9, 4 fours are 16, 5 fours are 25, 6 six are 36, 49, etc. These are all perfect squares. Next, uh, to find the square root of a perfect square number using prime factor method. That you know about how to uh, find uh, how to find a number that is using prime factorization. That is, you studied about the prime factorization method. Here, uh, to find a square root of a number, find the perfect uh, square of a square root of a number uh, using prime factor method. Here is a question for you: by splitting into prime factors. Find the square root of 11,025. By splitting into prime factors, find the square root of 1,000, 11,025. By using prime factorization method, that is equal to, how can I, that is 11025. And then divide it by, that is last digit is 5. So divide it by 5 and we get uh, 2, uh, 2, 0, 5. 2, 2, 0, 5. 
and then after that it's again 5 multiple of 5 that is 5 4s are uh, 20 uh, 2 balance and 20 that again 4 and 1 and it is divided by 7 7 uh, 7 6 are that is, uh, that is uh, uh, 42 then 2 balance that is equal to 21 3 and again it's divided by 3 that is equal to 9 7 are 63 and then again 3 3 and we can write it as that is 1 1 0 2 5 is equal to 11 thousand and 25 is equal to we can write it as 5 into 5 into 7 into 7 into 3 that is and after that uh, group the that is equal to we can write it in the form that is root of that is group group the digits that is in twos that is group in twos that is five seven that is again a three is there three into three and then after that take it outside that is five to take one outside that is five into from this group that is seven into three that is equal to five seven sir uh, that is uh, 35 into 3 is equal to 105. This is the answer. 5, 7, so 35 into 3 is equal to 105. This is the, uh, uh, that this is the square root of this number 105. Next question is, find the smallest number by which 10,368 be divided. So the, so that the result is a perfect square. Also find the square root of the resulting number. Find the smallest number by which 10,368 be divided so that the result is a perfect square. First you divide this by prime factorization but that is 10,368 that is by 2 is 5, uh, 5 2's are 10, uh, 1, 8, 4 and then again divide by 2 it's a multiple of 2 that is equal to 2, 5, 9, 2 and again then again it's a multiple of 2 then divided by 2 that is equal to 1, 2, 9, 0. And then again it's a multiple of 2 uh, that is 6, uh, 4, 8. And again then divided by 2 that is equal to 3, 2, 4. And then divided by again it by 2 that is equal to 1. Uh, balance 1 that is 6, 62 and then again it's divided by 2 that is equal to 81 that is equal to 81 is 3, 27, 27 is 3, 9, 3, 3 okay um, yes that is equal to we can write it as 1, 0, 3, 6, 8 is equal to root of root of that is 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 7, 2, so that is 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 2, and then 4, 3, into 3, into 3, into 3, into 3, okay, these are the factors of this 10,368, and after that, by grouping, that is here, these two, these two twos and then these twos and here there is a one a two left there is a two left and then after that three and three and here while grouping here is a two left 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 here uh, so uh, so that here uh, that is uh, one thousand ten thousand three hundred and sixty eight be divided so that that is equal to divided with the divided with that is equal to two into this this number that is 10,368 divided with the, that is by 2 that is 2 into 2 into 2 into 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7 into 7 into in uh, 3 into 3 into 3 into 3 and divide it back with a 2 and then cancels this 2 we get that is equal to from this we can take outside this 2 that is 1 2, 3 and this 3 into 3 that is equal to 2 into 2 into 2 into 3 into 3 is equal to that is 2 2s are 4, 4 2s are 8 that is into 3 uh, and that into 3 is equal to 7. 8, 24 into 3 is equal to 72. Yes, that is what is it? 
that is first you divided with prime factorization method that is here we get seven twos well, on, uh, while grouping that is there is a two left so how is it we divided that is the point that is we divided so divide the two with a two that is that cancel these twos we get we get that is two into two into two that is uh, by dividing this we get the perfect square 72 by dividing by dividing with the two we get the perfect square that is the this is the square root of by dividing we get the square root of that is equal to 72 next question evaluate root of 25 by 32 into 2 and 13 by 18 into 0 0.25 25 root of 25 by 32 into 2 and 13 by 18 into 0 0.25 that is equal to that is first you convert this to that is root of 25 by 32 into that is 2 into 18 18 into 2 is equal to 36 36 plus 13 is equal to 9 49 49 by 49 by 18 and then after that it is dividing by 100 there are two base values after decimal that is divided by 100 that is equal to that is uh, 25 by uh, 25 by 32 that is 5 into 5 5 into 5 by 32 is equal to 32 is equal to uh, 32 div divided by that is equal to 2 divided by 16 then uh, 8 2 4 2 2 that is 2 into 2 into 2 into 2 into 2 and then after that it is 7 into 7. 7 7 is 49. And then 18 is equal to. 18 is equal to what is 18? 18. 2. 9. 3. 3. 2 into 3 into 3. And then we can cancel this. That is 1 by 4. Into 1 into 2 into 2. By using prime factors. By using prime factors. That is by 4 is equal to. 2 into 2 and then after that taking this 1 5 outside and from here that is 7 outside and then in the denominator that is 1 2 3 and uh, this 3 2 that is 1 2 3 1 here from this 2 into from here also from this group also take 2 outside and then from this group 3 outside and then here 2 outside. That is equal to 35. 7 5 sir, 35 by 2 2 sir, 4, 4 2 sir, 8, 8 3 sir, 24, 24 into 2 is equal to 48. 35 by 48. This is the answer. Next section is to find the square root of a perfect square number using division method. In the previous case, we uh, applied the prime factorization method. Here it is using division method. And there is a question for you. Find the square root of 27, 66, 76. Uh, that is how can we divide this number? This, uh, div how can we divide it? There are uh, 6. This is, this is a 6 digit number. 276,676. And uh, how can we uh, find the square root of this number using division method? Listen carefully. And then first you write this number that is equal to. 2, 7, 6, 6, 7, 6. Okay. And then draw the, that is by using, that is, we, uh, usually we draw the division, that is line, that is here, this is the process. And then after that, group this digit in twos, that is 27, 66 and 76. First, uh, group this number in twos, that is 27, 66 and 76. And then after that, Take the first digit that is 20 and take a digit that is its square is that is lying inside this 27 not exceeding 27 and that is inside this 27 we take a perfect square that is equal to if we choose 4 4 4 4 star if we choose 4 here 4 4 star 16 and that is not uh, uh, suitable for this and after that if we select 5 5 5 star 25 here, this 25 is inside 27, that is, we take 5 here. And as also, here also, write 5. Here, uh, the, uh, the, the caution is 5, 
and then after that they do the minus it that is 27 minus 25 is equal to 2 2 and then second second step is put the 66 downwards that is take the 66 to here that is 200 and we get the digit 266 and after that at next step that is find the double of that is 5 find the double of this 5 that is take that is 5 into 2 is equal to or 5 plus 5 is equal to 5 into 2 is equal to 10 and then take a digit that is u double 4 uh, that is here that is take a digit that is if you can take any digit that is if 100 and if you take 1 that is multiplied with the same number that is 101 into 1 is equal to 1 101 that is not suitable, suitable here and then after that you can select 102 that is 2 2 into multiplied with the same number that is 2 and then 2 into 2 is equal to 4 0 2 2 0 4 that is if we, if we select 3 that is 102 into 3 100, 103 into 3 that is we get 3 3 is so 9 0 that is 3 that is this exit this so take 2 take 2 here that is multiplied with the 2 and we get that is what is it 2 0 4 2 0 4 and then subtract it that is equal to uh, 2 62 62 and then take the 76 downwards that is 76 right here 76 we get 6276 and then after that take the 10 here and then after that this right 2 here okay we select 2 that is after that multiply this 2 into 2 that is equal to that take the double of this 2 that is 4 what is it? First you take 5. 5 5 is 25. That is after that. Five. Take the double of this 5. That is 10. And then after that you can uh, select any number. That is uh, when we multiply with the same number. That is uh, we sh the, my answer should be uh, inside this 266. That is 204. And after that the put down the same, same number. That is 10. And after that double of this 2. That is 2 into 2 is equal to 4. And then after you can select any number another number that is here that is one zero four into one is equal to one into one is equal to one zero four one this is six thousand two hundred and seventy six okay you can select another number that is one zero four let's select five that is one zero four five in thousand forty five into five is equal to five five is a twenty five that is five four is a uh, twenty twenty two 2 that is equal to 5,225 5, and then okay next let's uh, do another number that is 4 6 into 6 that is 6 6 6 36 3 uh, 6 4 are 24 24 25 26 27 2 27 6 1 is 6 6276 that is we get the exact number 6276 and we can write here that is 4 we select which number that is equal to 6 is the number we selected and then here write 526 526 this is the square root of this number 2,76,676 the perfect square for this is equal to 526 526 Okay, to find the square root of a number which is not a perfect square. Next section is to find the square root of a number which is not a perfect square by using division method it is not a perfect square. That is here is a number find the square root of 24.729 correct to two decimal places of decimal. Okay, find the square root of 24.729 this is a decimal one. We need to find the uh, square root of that is this is not a perfect square uh, we that is by using division method that is by using division method that is in the previous case also right here that is 24.729 here we need three decimal that is corrected to two decimal places uh, so that we need three decimal values after decimal we need three decimal values and that in the previous I said in the previous case that is we we should uh, group this in twos that is here this first two second two and here there is only one so put a zero here put a zero here 
and then here after decimal we need three place values so that we need all the uh, we need after this we need two zeros two zeros also that is 24.729000 that why because it is we need after decimal we need three decimal places that is this is for one two and three okay and then first and then divided that is here this 24 so 5 into 5 is 25 that is not uh, gone that is uh, 4 that is 4 is the perfect square that is 4 4 is 16 and here is 4 and the balance is 8 balance is 8 and then put the that is put the decimal here there is a decimal and put the decimal here put the decimal here and then take down the 72 72 put down 72 and then that is equal to that is uh, multiply with the 2 that is equal to double of this one that is equal to 4 4 sir. 4 into 2 is equal to 8 4 2 are 8 and then after that we can select any number that is multiplied that is if it is 1 8 into, 81 into 1 is 81 uh, and you can choose 2 3 4 you can try this try this we get 9 okay 9 is the number 89 into 9 89 into 9 4 point Nine. That is 89 into 9 is equal to we get 861. 89, 89 into 9 is equal to 869. 61. That is we should multiply with the same number. That is take a number, suitable number. That is you can choose any number that is multiplied. Uh, we get that is inside this 872. That is 861. That is 71 is the, sorry. Uh, 872 and uh, 61 and here it is 801 uh, 89 uh, 9 and uh, 81 8 uh, okay that is equal to 800 801 that is equal to we get 71 is the balance 801 71 is the balance and then put the 9 0 here 9 0 here and then 8 8, uh, eight is there it is there and then we take it as 9, uh, 9, 9 into 2 that is equal to 18 and then 18 is equal to 818 and put this a 1 to the left side that is equal to we get 9, 8, 9, 8 and then 7, 9, 8 that is take the 7, 7 take the number 7 that is 987, 987 into 7 that is here I once again I repeat that is 9, 9, 9 into 2 is equal to 18. 9 into 18. That's one. Take 1 to the left side. And this changes to 9. That is 9, 8, 9, 8, 7. 7 is the number. 7 in 8, 9, 87 into 7 is equal to uh, 6, 9, 0, 9. 6, 9, 0, 9. And then that is equal to 9. Uh, that is the balances. The balances uh, that is uh, subtracting this we get 2. Mm, this is 1, uh, 8, 2, 281 and then put the two zeros here. Put two zeros here, 28100 0, 0, and then we get 9 and then <coughs> a, uh, 9, 8, 9, 8, uh, 4, that is equal to 14, that is 7, 14 and put, take, take the 1 to the left side, that is equal to 9. 8, 9, 9, 4, 9, 9, 4 and then after that 9, 9, 4 and after that it is 9, 9, 4, 2 into 2, 2 into 2 that is 9,942 into 2 is equal to that is 2 is equal to that is we multiply and we get that is equal to uh, 1, 9, 8, 1, 9, 8, 8, 4, 1, 9, 8, 8, 4 one nine eight eight four that is nine nine four two that is two is here that is four point nine seven two and here we subtract it we get the balance eight two one six eight two one six the balance is there is a reminder there that is eight two one six and here we need three decimal values that is four four point nine seven two is the value and we need we need three two decimal places that is correct to two decimal places that is equal to four point 97 that is equal to that is why this 2 is less than 5 so that uh, uh, remove this that is 2 that is we get 4.97 is the 
perfect square of this digit that is 24.729. Okay, find the value of a root 5, correct to two decimal places. Then use it to find the square root of 3 minus root 5 by 3 plus root 5, correct to two significant figures. Here, first of find the value of root 5. Here, this is the value of root 5 by using division method that is 5 point. Uh, that is we need that is here it is grouping by 2 that is at 0 0 0 0 0 0 and then first is 5 that is uh, that is this is the perfect square that is 2 into 2 is equal to 4 2 2 set 4 and then, then write the 2 here and subtract it we get 1 and then put the two zeros here and after that it is uh, multiply with 2 that is 2 2 set 4 and then take it the, uh, take any number you can select any number here uh, it is 2 to a 42 into 2 is equal to 84 and then subtract it we get 16 and then put the two zeros down and then after that 4 2 2s are 4 and then you can select another number that is here it is 3 443 into 3 443 into 3 we get 1329 1329 and then subtract it we get 271 and put the two zeros here and after that we get 4 this 4 and then this 3, 3 into 2, 6, 6 and then double it, that is 6 and after that we choose a number that is 6 and then multiply 4, 4, 4, 4, 4466 into 6 is equal to 26,796 and the, after subtracting it we get the remainder 304 and this is the decimal value of 5 that is 2.236, this is the square value of Square root of 5, root 5, root 5 is equal to 2.236. We can uh, find the value of root 2, root 3, root 5, root 7, etc. That is by using this method, that by division method. And you can put it, uh, that is, uh, uh, zeros and right side. After decimal, you can put zeros here. And we get the value, that is here, root 5 is equal to 2.236. And then after that, substitute this value, value in here. That is... 3 minus root 5 by 3 plus root 5. Here, there is a, a root in the denominator. So, you must change this root. And for, uh, what, uh, what we'll do, that is, by changing the denom root in the denominator, con the multiply the, with the conjugate of this, of this value. That is, 3 plus root 5. Conjugate of this value is equal to, if it is plus, Take the minus and if it is minus, take the plus. That is the conjugate. That is here the conjugate is 3 minus root 5. Multiply it with the conjugate on both numerator and denominator. That is root of 3 minus root 5 by 3 plus root 5 into with the uh, conjugate. That is root of 3 minus root 5. Sorry. Uh, 3 minus, uh, uh, not here. 3 minus root 5 by 3 minus root 5. 3 minus root 5 by 3 minus root 5. 3 minus root 5 by 3 minus root 5. And then after that, that is a minus b into a minus b. That is equal to a minus b root square. And here it is a plus b into a minus b is equal to a square, a square, a square minus b square. Root 5 the whole square. A square minus b square. 3 is the whole square minus root 5 the whole square that is equal to 3 minus 5 the whole square mm, that is 3 3 minus 5 the whole square is equal to 3 minus root 5 uh, uh, by that is 3 square is 9 minus 4 9 minus 5 is equal to 4 and we get that is you know right here 3 minus that is if this if we take the square that is that is 3, if we take the square, that is equal to uh, root of here. And the root is here. That is 3 minus, 3 minus, 3 minus root 5. What is the value of root 5? Root 5 is equal to 2.236. 2.22, that is we need 3, uh, sorry, 2 significant figures. We need 2 significant figures. So, take significant with figures means the number of digits in it. That is 1, 2, 3. That is the significant figure. 2.23 and take 1 to the left side. That is equal to 2.24. 2.24 divided by 4. 
ஒரு